What's up, everyone? Another Void back with more Factorio for you. Episode 99. 99. Next episode will be 100. This is... This right here uh, ties up with the longest series I've ever had. So let's get really into it. There's something I need to do. One of them is make a tool. Just ran out. Uh, and I'm just going to do this right away. I'll talk about what I'm going to do in, what I'm doing in a second. So Ethereal Phoenix was commenting on episode 97, I think, where I was saying, hey, this system doesn't seem to be balanced. Something's wrong with this system. I'm getting more waste than I'm putting in, and then I can't put enough water in. And see how the train gets stopped up right there? So he's saying, hey, dude, you got that extra input. And I'm like, what are you talking about? It's 2.5 in, 2.5 out, so it should be balanced. He said, no, you've got that water coming in in the south right there that you added in. I was like, oh, crap, yeah. And it's funny because... And this happens actually a lot. I'm just going to reset this system. This will be fine for us. Remember, it's it should be even, so it shouldn't matter that we don't have a lot of water coming in because it should be the exact same amount of waste going out, so it shouldn't be that big a deal. Um, but it's funny that a lot of times someone will start commenting, and I'll figure out, or I'll figure out something before they comment on it, and it makes it look like, Oh, they figured it out, and I'm just trying to take credit for it or something like that. I mean, nobody's ever said that. I just always felt like that. But it literally is. I figured it out because I was kind of messing around with that when those when his comments were coming in. And uh, I figured it out right right before his comment came in. But it's cool that he saw it, too. I'm really glad because if I didn't see it at all, then I'd have been screwed. So cleaned all that up. We don't need that anymore. In fact, probably don't need any of this stuff either. Let's just get rid of all of it. We're good to go there. We're still going to need all this crushing. We're also going to change up a lot of this stuff. We do not need any more of these chunks, so I'm going to remove them. Now, hopefully, we don't have too many chunks up there to deal with. We don't want any more chunk processing coming out of here. So, we're going to pull this whole system out. I should have probably left those in, actually. Damn it. That's okay. So, we don't want any of this. We're not doing any chunk processing of this. So that means we don't need any of this. We just need that to stay. Everybody else has their own thing. So only... So these actually, I think, are all their own deals now. They all have their own waste. And it's separate from everybody else. So what I'm going to do is tell it, yank all this stuff out. Well, first let's go pick up all the chunks, because I know that's going to be a big problem. With uh, the bots, they're going to take forever just picking all this stuff up, so... Let's make sure we can get as much of this off the belt as we can here. There we go. Then it'll be easier for the bots to pick it up. Because they won't have to deal with picking up all these little uh, chunks and stuff. Cool. So, the reason I'm going to rip this out is because the one thing I was thinking about is that sometimes I need only iron and or only copper or something like that. And there's really, and that's usually mostly what I need. I think my problem is going to be, I don't want to throw away any ore. So I could just over-process the other ores and throw away the extras like gold or aluminum that I don't need. And we'll probably have to do some of that, but I want to keep that to a minimum. So I was thinking, how do I do that? Well, the one way that I can do it is to process, um, is to process just the crushed, right? Because we have a recipe where you can process... Uh, just crushed ores, you have to mix two of them together, and you get pure, you know, you get iron or copper, pure. Like, you don't have to screw around, you know. And uh, I don't want to take that out. That's part of the main system, so let's not screw around with that. So, I think that's what I'm going to do. I'm going to have two lines that mix the javolite and, and uh, javolite and saffrite, right? the crushed, and then another line that mixes the crushed stertite with crushed, I, I can't remember what it is. I think it's, uh, I think it's crontinium, I do believe, but I'm not positive off the check. So that means we don't want any of these, and I'm glad we don't have a lot. We don't want any of these guys. So let's just uh, replace these with regular so that they'll actually process and get rid of all the chunks. We don't want any of these chunks. We want them to process all the way through. And then we'll deal with the aftermath uh, after that. We'll just leave these in to let them process. And uh, I'm going to take this out so that 
it won't process down here anymore. Let me do the same thing over here. And we'll end up having to put those back because I'm going to be using this to process crushed, remember? So let's get all these out. I'm going to make sure I process all of them because they're not these chunks are not going to do us any good once I do the switch. So let's just do that. And again, I don't want to take up the systems. The systems are fine. They're good. Um, I only want to get rid of... Oops. In fact, we don't even need these anymore. Right? Which is good because we actually need more splitters. All I want to do is uh, process the crushed now. And I want to get rid of all those chunks so that... Well, we're going to have a little bit. And I have some on me, so why don't we just do this? Let's give each of them a, a few, a, some to process here. So that we can process out all these chunks. As many as we can. I know we probably won't be able to process them all, but we'll try. So let's do the same thing here. And it's also going to make our processing system a little easier down here, which is going to be kind of nice. So I'm kind of looking forward to that. Because this system right here was way too snaky. I was trying to figure out how we're going to deal with having all that excess. And there's really not a, 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 an easy way to do it. So now this will make it pretty easy. Because this stuff's going to flow directly into the warehouses. There's nothing to sort. It's going to flow right in. And the way we're going to set this up also, which really I'm just talking. Um, there's a really, I don't need to talk this much about it. I can really just start doing it in a second here. Uh, is I'm going to make the systems that produce pure iron or copper to only run when the other chunk systems are not running. Because when those are running, it, it either means I need the precious metals or I'm running out of iron and copper, right? So these are only going to run, these systems are only going to run when the warehouses are half full or less. Uh, I'm going to start all bursted out. These will be burst systems, okay? So those guys look like they're pretty much processed up. I know these guys are. So what I'm going to do is pick these up now. And I'll just throw the chunks away. It's not that big a deal. Uh, and then I'll replace it. And I don't need these down here now. Let's, whoa, where are... There they are. So I'll replace these with the chunk uh, crushed versions. Well... Yeah, because they're not connected to any... Well, they're still connected to that, but that's fine. We're going to fix that. So this is going to be copper processing. So it is stertite and crontinium. And that's fine. We'll deal with that in a second. Uh, hold on a second. I need to itch. Man, I can't do it while the microphone's on. Sorry, that ear was bugging the crap out of me. Okay, so, so that's reset. We're going to reset this one as well, since it looks like they're done processing. And then we'll set this one up for crushed as well. Get these crushed systems all piped in. They're gonna we're gonna have to redo the piping down below, but that'll be fine. So we can also do lead if we wanted to, and tin. I'm not sure I'm gonna be doing those because I think we're gonna get plenty of lead and stuff out of the other systems. We might not. It's hard to say because if you look at, we don't get any lead out. Of, we get tin out of this guy. We won't be processing that anymore. We're still gonna be processing processing javolite chunks. Because we're going to get aluminum and zinc out of that, or nickel, aluminum and nickel, plus those gems. Uh, here we get lead and, and silver, plus, again, crystals. Aluminum and gold, uh, cobaltite, I think, and nickel, which will be good. And the, this is like everything, right? Lots of tin. So actually, this one, which one's the, yeah, here we go, lots of lead. So I think we're going to be fine on the tin and the lead. I'm not positive. We might have to do burst systems on those two. Hopefully not, because we really don't have the room. I didn't set it up to have that enough room to do that. So we'll see. We might have to rip out some of these systems and, and just use like single systems for the smaller ores. So this stuff's all set up still pretty good. Let's get the car out here, because we're going to be doing a lot of driving around. Fixing stuff. Which means we aren't going to need that anymore. This is going to come straight off of... Um, the regular system, it's not going to generate geodes. We can pick all this stuff up too. In fact, let's just do it like this. We don't really have time. What are you doing? So let's pick all this up. There we go. And we also don't need the loaders now. 
which means we also don't need that or that. And then this can all be just single instead of fast belt, it can be regular belt. There. Okay. That's kind of good. That really saves us a lot of hassle, really. So again, here, we're not going to be doing, we're only going to be doing one line of stir type because the other line is going to be crontinium. So let's take that out. We're also going to fix this one up a little bit, I think. The crontinium is going to run here. The javolite, do we have enough space for two? I think we do. We have two lines worth of space. Yes, we can still run two lines up here. So what we're going to do is we're going to have to move this and then have a line coming out right there. So let's pick that up and replace that. Man, my mouse is kind of freaking out. So I think it can go there, like that. Honestly, I kind of like it. I'd rather have it down there. So what we're going to do is we're going to put a line in right here. We're going to say Javolite only. Crush Javolite only. Okay, we have not a lot. We have some. We're going to need to get more Javolite. That's another thing we're going to have to do. Uh, we're going to do the same thing here. This Crontinium is kind of set up funky. I'd rather set it up up here. I'm not sure I can do that. Because remember, we have to make that turn. Not, I might be able to move it over even more. This goes straight in. I can't do that because that only leaves me one. Oh, well, like, yeah, I can. I can do it right there. No, because this needs one extra space. You know, to make it easy, I could pull the crontinium off right here and just put it underneath. That's what I'm going to do. I'm not going to get too crazy with this. So let's tell it crontinium only. Crushed. Let's just do that. It makes it sim more simple here. Alright, crontinium only is going on for there, and we'll put it underneath. Do we need a fast belt? No. We'll do it to there. We'll have crontinium be the uh, upper band here. We have tons of, of crontinium. We have no, no problems there. So this is what we're going to have to do. So this is going to be a long line of crushed. So what we're going to have to do... Oh, I'm getting attacked. Oh, we've got that handled. It'll be fine. Are they running out of... Hmm, we might have to go check that. They might be running out of repair kits. So what we're going to do is I'm just going to pipe this the whole way. I don't really care that it's going to take up a lot of uh, ch crushed. Uh, and then what we're going to do is gate it when it gets closer to here when it gets closer to the actual processing area and it's just going to say moved some crushed in as we have uh, as needed so we're going to have a lot of crushed on the belt okay but it is what it is at this point it's fine so it's going to run up here it's just going to run right into that So I kind of want to run the crushed in there, but I don't. Let's go check out what we got first. Because this is going to start making tons of copper, and I'm not really sure I'm ready for that. Let's just do this. Well, we're definitely going to be taking this out. We're going to have to move all this crap. For now, we'll just do this. That way it can produce, it can do everything it needs to do, but it'll get stopped up relatively quickly. And then we can put um, our system in to tell it when to stop doing that crap. There we go. So again, that's going to drain out a lot of this stuff. It's fine. It's not that big of a deal. Uh, I don't like to have a lot of stuff on belts because you have a lot of potential on the belt. I don't really like that. But in this instance, I'm not going to worry about it. It just is what it is. Same with the Javolite. I mean, we can only do we you know we can only do so much. It's only so much worrying, right? So this is going to need to be fast because it's got to go under a relatively large area. Actually, well, let's do it anyway. It's just more. It's prettier that way. 
I don't like uh, them connecting like that. So it's going to have to go under this as well. And then this is going to meet up with this one. We also don't need any of this. We don't need this one. This is just going to run right alongside this guy. Oops. Oh, you know what? We can't do it this way. This is not going to work. We have to mix these two. So we're going to have to mix them. We should mix them right here. So these guys should have none. See what I mean? So we got to mix this stuff up. So we're going to have to put um, one of these guys in here. And let's do this. Let's pick all this crap up too. That way they'll get a relatively even mix. It's not going to be perfect, but it should be good. Oh yeah, it is perfect. So we'll do the same thing here before we do this, since we just figured out that that's not going to work. And now they should be good to go. They'll start processing. They have an exact even amount. Actually, no, now it's just flipping the whole thing. Okay, that's not going to work either. Alright, so how the hell are we going to do this? Why is it... <sighs> We're going to have to do some tricks with this. I hate that crap. Huh. How are we going to... How are we going to do this? So, we could do... Okay, we'll do it like this. Let's see. Man, someone's blowing my phone up. We'll take that out. Hmm. This is dumb, man. How do you mix these two? I used to know this stuff like no problems. Like it was, you know, super simple. But what we could do is we peel this off. Hmm. Okay, here's what we're going to do. So we'll split this like that. No, we'll do it on the out outside, I think. So we'll split it before it merges. Then we're going to do this. Like that. But we're going to do this. This is going to be weird, but we're going to try something weird. Uh, That's not going to work because all, all this crap's in the way. So what we're going to do... Man, this sucks. <laughs> I hate this. I'm surprised it wouldn't just mix it up. It would if I had one coming out, it would mix it. But I need two vol I need a lot of volume. I need to keep that volume. I, if if I put this into one belt, it cuts the volume I'm putting through in half. It cuts the throughput in half, and I don't want that. So this will then do this. See, we're going to have to move that anyway. It's fine. We're going to move that. Because I like it better like this. So this will do this as well. Okay. Just just p bear with me here. You'll see what I'm doing. Think if you, you probably already know what I'm doing, but... There. So what I'm going to do is this will only give me... Well, this won't matter. I can just run this right into that. Oops. Like that. I can do that. That's not a big deal. The thing is, this has to move way back. Because I can't turn and go underneath. Hmm. 
All right, so, oh, that's how I want to do this. Okay, so what I want to do is I want to do this really close to the belt. Okay, so that I want to make these exactly the same because I hate when I do a system like this and they have to be kind of lopsided. So we're going to do it like this. This comes out very far. So this is going to go in really tight as well. So first, before we do this part, we'll do this other part first. So the same thing's going to happen here. It can't. Those are going to get screwed up. All right, we'll have to go. We'll have to go down here and do it. Well, this. See, it's still going to be lopsided. There, we'll just do it like that. I don't give a crap. All right, so now we're going to have to put the splitter here. Come on. You know, why don't I just do this? If this is going to here, I can just put it underneath. Why would I need to? And then I can just go under. Then I could just pipe this directly into this. All right, let's rethink this. There might be a way easier way to do this. I'm sure you guys are like, oh, it's super easy. What are you doing? You're being dumb. And, and I agree with you. It's pretty stupid at this point. Okay, so we got this, but really we want it to come out. Really we want it to be right here because we're going to have to turn it to come in right here. And then that's going to come out right there. Damn it. There. All right. And this side is going to come in right here. The opposite side. Okay. Actually, this is super easy with those splitters. And this is exactly how it should be. So what I'm going to do is go like this. Mm, that might not work. Ah, uh, I know how I'm going to do this. Watch this. Okay, so then I'm going to go underneath this guy. And then come up to here. That's really stupid, but hey, it's the way it has to be. So for this, I'll do the same because I'll come out an extra piece here. So at least it, it's sort of sym sym symmetrical, right? All right, so that should work now. But let's make sure it doesn't get very far, right? It has to go to right there. Oh no, that's the input. Okay, so what we're going to do is take these out to make sure that it's correct before it actually does anything. So let's see what happens. And yes, that is how it should be. There, it's it's even now. Good. Okay, so that works. We're going to copy that and use it in the other one. Wait, what? What is going on with this? There we go. There. Okay, everybody should be working now. Good. Okay, we got to copper building up. That's the exact system I want. It slows it down a little bit, but it's fine. Uh, we can ditch that now. What is this? Whoa! Wow, they couldn't kill him fast enough. Oh crap! We got we got major problems over there. They're gonna get through the wall. We're gonna have to reinforce that with more lasers, probably. So let's go down here and get some because we have tons. We'll just whoa, whoa! Not a good place to go. All right, laser turrets. I think they're down here. Ah, oh, I should have sorted this thing. Uh, how about just give me the laser turrets? Give me laser turrets. Give me all the lasers. Do I want wall? How about give me some wall as well? Well, probably a hundred. I have enough of the of of this everything else. I just need wall because I don't I don't really carry wall on me, right? All right, so I got wall building up somewhere. Where is it? Okay, there it is. Forty. 
All right, we're good on lasers. We don't need any more lasers. That's probably plenty of wall. I think, yeah, we're good with wall. All right, let's get out of here. Let's go handle that. Yeah, we cannot have them destroying lasers because we can't make any more right now. That's one, one of the reasons. Two, because they're going to get through. You know, there's not going to be anything there to kill them anymore. So, we got to beef this thing up. Probably also ran out of repair kits. Or they couldn't repair them fast enough or something. And that's always good. No, they got repair kits. Is it that we don't have the bots over here? Probably. Alright, so we need more lasers here, right? Wow, they destroyed three lasers. I think I'm just gonna build this by hand. Let's 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 expand this by hand. Alright, so we got wall lasers. And then let's expand it this way a little bit here. So what they're going to do, though, is they, they figure out where the weaknesses are. So this might not really help that much. Because they're just going to move around where we don't have as many lasers. And I know they could come right now and just jack me up. But our lasers will get them. We'll be fine. Alright, so now we need lasers in there. That should do it. And more of these. There we go. So that should be enough. And they have plenty of these. And we might as well just lay, down, lay these down while we're over here. Oops, they're going the wrong direction. Might as well go pick that stuff up because you know it's just going to sit there. All right, so we got plenty of that stuff happening. Good. All right. Can't put one on that side, so we'll start over here. And this is just going to agitate them more, but I don't give a crap. There we go. The spice must flow, right? We've got we've got way too much stuff of this coming in anyway, so I'm probably going to kill this. We have enough rubite, so let's kill that. Because I think what's happening over over in the other area is the rubite warehouse is full. So, man. Thought we cleared that out a little bit. Let's follow the train because I don't know where the forests are. But uh, the rubite is full and it's backing up the receiving warehouse. So that's never good. We don't have our system set up yet uh, that says, hey, excuse me, uh, we have enough ore. Stop, stop getting more. So we need to, to eventually set that up. I just, I'm not exactly sure how to. And that's how you die. Or that's how your car dies. Damn it! That's the second car I've lost that that way. And I'm running out of engines, so I kind of need to be careful. <laughs> Damn it! Oh, it's only eight engines. Okay, well. All right, let's get uh, let's get our car out. And. Lacking on coal, and now I'm lacking on piercing rounds, but that's okay. So as you can see, the uh, ruby rubite is done. Like it's like, hey, please don't give me any more. And this is like almost full. So we almost have two warehouses full of it. So what I'm gonna do is make another warehouse over here, like I did for these other guys. And I can almost start moving the sapphire out of there, but not quite. So let's do this again. Um, put a warehouse down. Okay, we should be able to handle it with nine lasers. Hurry up and repair. I'm going to bring some more bots over there next time, too.
I think we need more bots. Ooh, we have more uh, Javolite. That's good, because we need more. Uh, do I have a warehouse? Yes, I do. Let's put one of these warehouses down, down here. Alright, I'll just transfer all that Rubite in there. There we go. There's so much that... I'm not sure how we're gonna... Let me just do this. Oops. That shouldn't have more than that. There we go. Okay. So, clear out that problem. But really, we need that system that says, hey, we have X amount, and you don't need to do anything. Um, the best way to do that is to hook the logistics network up everywhere. We can't do that yet. So I'm just going to turn it off by hand um, for now. But we'll fix that in the future. Future. If you know what that's from, you're pretty cool. So we fixed this up. Look, this has not enough now. So I don't, this shouldn't be given, oh, it is given a signal. It has a little bit more than, than, uh, enough in here to do, it's still coming in. Oh, it's because we're doing bobmonium. And bobmonium produces, uh, sulfuric. So that's gonna run for a while, to be honest. Actually, we're, ran, we're running out of bobmonium now. Okay, well, that's good. Alright, so now we're ready to hook this system up since we kind of fixed the other one. Well, actually, we didn't. We fixed this system, but we did not fix the Saffrite uh, Javolite system. So let's go Let's go hook that up. Oh, that's going to make this fun. We're going to have to do that down here. Okay, no problems. That We can do that. It's fine. I'll just take this out by hand. It's probably faster. And then we'll just use these as our entry points. All right, so let's copy this. I want to put that right there. And then we're just going to hook these two, two dudes up to it. So they go on the inside. Like that. I probably don't have any more, um, we can give it some of these, because I don't think I have any more splitters. So that'll give us, give us an even uh, input right there. These guys are going get, to get some splitters and put them in. Okay, we've still got a lot of splitters that need to go over there. Why don't I just make some splitters? Apparently we need a lot more of them. There we go. We need a lot. Alright, so that looks like it's in. There's one more. Why don't we just put a splitter here so they don't have to worry about it. And we'll give them, again, half as much of my splitters. Maybe. There we go. They're going to go put those in. That should take care of it, but we'll, we'll see. Oh, did I also unhook this? I didn't. So let's unhook that so we don't produce too much iron, like, immediately, right? What's this? Oh, unnecessary. Because those are that's output, and there's obviously no output coming from this side. Alright, so let's hook the rest of this system up and get the iron uh, running as well. There. There. Now we will get some iron production coming in. And that will fix that up. Okay, yeah, at least at least that much. Let's get some more Javolite in here, since we have a lot of crushed. Let's fill this warehouse back up, or this storehouse. Oops. I need to clear out a lot of the ore that I have, too, because... There we go. Oh, okay. So, working through our extra Javolite as well got a lot of extra crushed saffrite, which means we probably 
since we have all that extra, why don't we, we're going to cut this off. Well, we have, how much of this ore do we have? Remember, we're trying to work through our excess. Oh, we have a lot of extra ore. Why don't we just let the ore process out? Because I think we have more crush than we do ore. So let's do that. Is it not making any more of this? Oh, it's not hooked up. Why would it not be hooked up? There we go. So now we're crushing more of that ore. Got to get through our um, excess there. Cool. So we've got that. We've got... Oh, we're five minutes over. Uh, we got our two uh, main iron and copper producers set up. So if we just need iron or just copper, it's not going to be a big problem. And then everything else is, gener is generally speaking, specialty ores like, uh, you know, gold and stuff like that. And we'll deal with how to uh, figure out how to do excess amounts of those later. Um, and I think we're going to get enough lead and tin to not have to worry about making those special lead and tin uh, sorters. We might have to do it eventually, but I don't think we're going to have to do it right away. So I think we'll be fine. So thanks for watching episode 99. Hope you enjoyed it. Leave comments in the comment section. Let's talk about this. Uh, again, we're really deep into the series for how far I feel like we've got with this factory. But that's because we've got so many mods and there's a lot more stuff to do. Episode 100, going to be awesome. Uh, I might think about doing something different on episode 100. Probably not, though. Uh, we just have a lot of work to do, so I don't want to waste too much time. I do want to start getting in some of this freeway here. Uh, and I want to put freeway probably right here as well, so we might turn it a little bit. Uh, but I really want to start getting that in so I don't produce over it. I don't build over it. I've been doing that a little bit, and I'm, it, it's not a good idea. So anyway, thanks for watching, and I'll see you tomorrow. Stay frosty.